or its equivalent, um, a document that you're more in charge of the formatting, the ordering, the emphasis, the bolding, the, 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 the fonts, um, perhaps even the wording, and not just boxes that got ticked. Experience here, yes. Degree here, yes. What level, bleh. Any overseas, yes, no. The resume you can nuance. And, and so that, that's kind of where I'm headed with this question is uh, what if you were, what if it's, what if it's at the database level yes. and it says, do you have experience overseas? And you go, well, let me tick yes, because I think that's what they have in mind in the actual interview. If it comes up, I'll say, I, I actually don't. It says here, uh, if you can see my resume. It, 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 it doesn't, uh, you know, that wasn't a lie. I must have missed the box or blame them on the database. But you used that in order to get some advantage over somebody else who was perhaps a little more careful answering the yes, no questions. I have a couple so, of thoughts on that. 